Last week we previewed the women's track and field season and right now we take a look at the men's indoor track and field team as they prepare for two home meets inside the Unidome in January. The UNI men's track and field team is looking to build off the MVC team title at one during the outdoor season. We only graduated one person from the championship team from the outdoor uh, meet and so uh, we have a lot of guys coming back that are very familiar being in this situation, uh, a high, you know, high, high impact, high stressful, uh, important meets and so uh, hopefully that gives us some advantage on the other teams but the indoor and outdoor championships are very different meets and so you have a lot more events outdoors than you do indoors and so uh, points are more at a premium indoors especially just you don't have as many events, uh, we don't have as many throwing events and the throwers are a big part of what we do and so uh, it's really again it's about maximizing your opportunities but I do like the fact that we are a veteran team uh, and so we can come to this meet being confident that we've been there before and we know what to expect. UNI's deepest event might be the 400 meter dash where the Panthers sent five individuals to the MVC finals a year ago. However the Panthers are looking for production in nearly every event this season. I mean, we're a really balanced team, and so we've probably been uh, the most balanced we've been in, in a long time, uh, from the short sprints all the way to the field events. And so, uh, it's, it's really just going to be we need to we need to find a way to score points in all of the events that, that are, that's out there. And so we have to make some ground up in, in some of the distance events, and I think we have the guys that can do that now. Uh, we had a really good cross country season, and those guys are looking really uh, strong as they transition from cross country to track. You and I will host two meets the final weekend of January in the Unidome and then prepare to maximize their effort and maximize their points at the MVC Championships on their home turf. Uh, the message from the coaching staff of the athletes is, is last year was in the past and uh, it's great. We have the, the numbers on the wall now. We have that championship, we have the trophy, but uh, this year, you know, everyone's coming for us. And so it's a little bit of a different mindset, <clears throat> but they really adapted well to that. And, and practice is competitive from, from the sprints to the throws to the jumps. It's, uh, it's a fun competitive environment. and. Uh, you know, I'm just anxious to get the season started because you, you train all fall and, and you don't really get to see too much competition before you head into to winter break. And so now that they're, we're back and getting going, it's going uh, to be fun to see where we're at here the first few weeks. 